I first learned of my Irish heritage as a young kid. My mother and father's families are from uh, Ireland. My dad used to go over every summer, um, you know, since his father came directly from Ireland. The first time I went back uh, was when I was 10. I was actually fortunate enough to bring a town championship trophy that I won in Little League uh, to some of my uh, cousins and, and relatives over there, which was awesome. I was able to travel there with some family, um, see all the different places, Galway, Dublin, um, Killarney, all the spots. Um, Cliffs of Moore was probably uh, the coolest spot that I saw. I don't know why I got close to the edge, but um, at the time, it seemed fun to do. Looking back on it, it might have been a little bit dangerous. I'd say what makes me most proud is just the community feel um, that all Irish uh, people have uh, as far as being from there or having relatives from there or being part Irish. Uh, I think it's really cool. I was also fortunate to grow up in Boston, which has a lot of Irish um, heritage there as well. It's really cool to be a dual citizen. Maybe someday I'll be able to play for the Irish national team. Um, you never know, but uh, that's probably the coolest part about being a dual citizen and being able to um, you know, travel back and forth a little bit easier. As far as uh, music from Galway, uh, that's awesome. You guys are featuring it this year at Irish Fest. Um, I'm a big fan of Irish music. My parents always have it playing, uh, especially at our beach house back home um, during the day, just on the stereo. Um, and they just keep it going. I've always been a big fan of uh, Conor McGregor, who obviously walks out to some Irish music, which uh, I've always thought if um, you know I ever played pro baseball later on in my life, uh, I'd try to incorporate that into my walkout song as a pitcher. It's awesome to be in Wisconsin. I know it has one of the li largest Irish communities. Uh, I've definitely felt the love so far. Hopefully I'll be able to do some cool things this year um, with the Bucks to kind of um, you know, show more of my Irish heritage and things of that nature. As far as the nickname Aer Lingus, I didn't even know I had that nickname, if we're being honest. Uh, my aunt was uh, thought about it a while back, but I had never heard it um, besides that one time that she mentioned it. But, you know, it would be pretty cool to work with Aer Lingus and uh, get a deal going uh, since I can jump a little bit. And obviously they're the uh, best airline in the Irish airline. I think that would be a pretty unique uh, marketing ploy. So I should probably reach out to them. thing is just being a part of the community it must be really awesome to you know discover roots discover your 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 part of the Irish family and I think um, you know the flag down to the shamrock down to just the culture over in Ireland if you haven't been to be able to go over and see it um, is what makes it so special it's amazing I can't wait to get back there hopefully in the next year or two I'll be able to go back um, and see it and see some relatives and things of that nature um, but I uh, hope you guys are enjoying it um, really happy to be here in Milwaukee as part of the Irish family and uh, you know if you see me around uh, feel free to uh, reach out to me and, and yell something uh, about it. Mm -hmm.